Hello. Today I would like to bring you a teaching video that I haven't come out with for a long time, but should increase your currency per hour by 10 to 20 percent, no matter what you're currently farming. Uh, I personally have been pushing this off for a little bit because I've been mainly, mainly focusing on finding the best farms, but this is more or less how to min-max those best farms, which I in the community have generally uh, come to a consensus on. So here, what you're looking at right now is a regex, which previously couldn't be done since there was limitations on the number of characters. GGG this patch buffed it to 250 characters, so we can more or less roll our maps way, 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 way more efficiently. So it looks a little complex. I will make it simple. So on the far left is modifiers that you do not want to run on your map. Um, Hopefully, most builds that you are running run or are able to run most um, map modifiers since risk scarabs are so good. But these, there are three modifiers that I don't like running because even though I can run them, they slow down my mapping by 20 to 30 percent at least. So, on the far left, in quotations, are three modifiers that I do not run. And you can find these modifiers by going to the Regex website and clicking what you don't want. So let's, for example, say you do not want to run negative 20% max res. Now, in quotes, will be uh, a thing that you can paste in your regex, and then uh, you will no longer r be running negative 20 max res unless you run risk errors. And then we can add additional modifiers. So let's say you can can't run these four modifiers. These will be in your regex. So that's the first quotes. The second quotes in... The quotes don't have to be necessarily in order, this is just how I do it, but the second quotes is what you need on your maps. So I am currently farming currency. Uh, I'm trying to get, get uh, mirror drops and um, lock drops, so I want currency rolls on my map. And so this is in the quotes. This basically says I require 140% currency on my maps. And again, you can go to the Regex website and you can put in 140 currency, and this is what it will spit out. So now, okay, this is the bad stuff. It's not going to be on my maps. This is currency. This will be on my maps. And then this is an adi in addition to this. So in addition to having 140% currency, I also want to have 35%. I, or I potentially want 35 pack size. So this is 35% pack size. And then instead of quotes, I put a line because it's an or statement. This is like guaranteed has to be on my maps. These lines are ors, like 35% pack size or 190 currency or 120 quant or the Schaefer modifier or better rares. So uh, again, line, 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 separating all these, but all these ors will be in quotes. So for example, when I'm rolling maps, uh, let's say I roll a map. None of them will have less than 140% currency because of this, but it could have 140 currency, 35 pack size, and it will show up, or it might have 140 currency and a shaper modifier, it will show up, and um, yeah, so this is kind of complicated. Hopefully this is much more simplified, and I'm not going to lie to you, this is like insane for currency per hour. I didn't, I didn't know how good this was until I uh, self-taught myself this today. And um, you kind of, so how I came up with these numbers, like 140% currency, is that I looked up all the T17 map modifiers and what they give. So there are quite a bit of T17 um, map modifiers that give currency, but a lot of them give 70% currency. So Basically, when I make my regex 140, it is requiring at least two modifiers of currency. So it'd be 70-70, it could be 70-84, it could be 84-126. Either way, it's going to be over 140. And then additionally, how I get to uh, currency 190, which is another or option, is uh, again, it's 70 currency, 126 currency, or 100 currency, uh, 80 currency, or 90 currency. And then same thing with pack size. Uh, typically when you're rolling T16 and a half maps, you're going to have four or five modifiers mostly. Uh, so 
this is basically encompassing, again, the map is basically or always going to have two currency rolls, but one of those four or five rolls might be plus 15 pack size, which would, uh, this uh, part of the regex would encompass that. So it would be two currency rolls plus a pack size roll, or this could be two super high currency rolls and then two other rolls, or this could be two currency rolls and then two high quant rolls, or again, this could be two currency rolls and a shaver. So hopefully that is easily understandable. Again, if you're farming scarabs, then this URR, which stands for currency, would be scarabs. Or if you're just looking for pack size, you would just do pack size 150 here to guarantee 100 or pack size or whatever. But yep. hopefully that's simple. Hope you guys learned something. Peace.